Hi, everyone. Um, I'm very excited to be here today. My name is Lalip. I'm from Israel, and I'm going to be talking more about it. So I wanted to begin. Um, you probably, most of you knew Dol. Uh, so this is in the loving memory of Dol. He was a good friend of mine. Uh, he wrote more than 8,752 articles. Um, he won the Wikimedia Prize last year. And he actually wrote over 2% of the entire Hebrew Wikipedia, which is a lot. So um, I really miss him. Um, he taught me many things I know about Wikipedia. Uh, he gave me a warm welcome, and we'll talk more about him. So I believe we all have a story to tell. I'm going to be telling you a little bit of mine. We're going to talk about local community, not just a virtual one. Uh, of course, the gender gap and women writing. But first, I want to introduce myself. Uh, you all know what BARD is. It's a generative AI developed by Google. I will let Lalit him Gao is a Wikipedia editor, blogger, and marketing professional from Israel. She is currently the manager Laliv Gao is a Wikipedia editor, blogger, and marketing professional from Israel. She is currently the manager of digital marketing and content creation at Clalant Health Services, Israel's largest health maintenance organization. She is also a managing editor at the Wikimedia Foundation, the nonprofit organization that operates Wikipedia. In addition to her work in marketing and technology, Laliv is also a passionate advocate for social justice and inclusion. Okay, so you heard her. Um, yeah, that's me, Wikipedia editor, social media manager, uh, passionate advocate. He said that. Actually, in Hebrew, it's a female voice. I feel like it even more. Um, so I started in 2016 uh, writing Wikipedia. Uh, I write about many different subjects um, uh, women, art, and food. Um, so here's the situation in the world. I know it has been changed, but today we're going to be talking about Israel. So that's the situation in Israel. Um, and now uh, I want you to think about what could be the reason for that. Uh, I just want to say that my talk is mainly about women editors, um, mostly, and not about the article itself. So I want you to think about what could possibly be the reason for that. And here is one idea, size matter. And I'm talking about our country size, of course. And of course, community matters. Yeah, we're that small. Has anyone ever been to Israel? Oh, OK. So it's going to be easier for you to answer that. How many people live in Israel? You have three options. Who thinks number one? Raise your hand. Who thinks number two? Please raise your hand. And number three. OK, yeah, most of it got it right. 9.7. What is the area size? Who thinks number one? Who thinks number two? And the last one? Yeah, you got it right. That's the last one. 22,000. How long does it take to drive from north to south, approximately? Two and a half hours, seven hours, or 14 hours? Who thinks number one? Number two? And number three? You got that right, too. Yeah, it's seven hours with traffic, I would say. So we all know that, uh, that we have some historic reason for the gender gap. Uh, it used to be before that you needed to know how to write code in order to write articles in Wikipedia. It's not really like that anymore, but the gender gap still exists, right? 
So, uh, yeah, that's me with my sister. I have four other siblings. Um, I grew up in a kibbutz. Do you know what a kibbutz is? Anyone know? Yeah, so according to Wikipedia, as an international community in Israel that was traditionally based on agriculture, according to me, this is something which is really hard to explain from someone from the outside. But uh, the main thing was, and actually still is, a community. Okay, so for me, it always mattered. Uh, I always wanted to feel part of something. Yeah, that's me right here. Um, and this is uh, something else I have in Wikipedia. I always love to write, and I actually had my blog. Um, and I kind of have that feeling that uh, I put lots of effort in my post, in my blog, and no one really read that. And one day someone told me, why don't you join Wikiwoman? I mean, number five website in the world. People will probably read what you write, right? Uh, so, yeah, that's what I did. I joined Wiki Woman. Um, and today, uh, it's not only that I write, I also feel that I'm part of something bigger. Again, this word, community. I know many editors. Uh, some of them are my friends, uh, not just Wiki friends, and we really meet. So, um, Wikimedia Israel uh, aware of the importance of us of getting together. So, we meet at least twice a year. We have Hebrew Wikipedia birthday and Wikipedia birthday. Okay, so you can see January 2020. Yeah, I'm here. July 2021, I'm here. And then again, we always have cake. 17k, yeah, we, we love we love the cake. Israel, for Israel, is, yeah, it's all about food. And so why do sh so many people show up? Because they can. Remember that map? So if we meet in Tel Aviv, it won't take us more than an hour or two to get there for most of us. I don't live in Tel Aviv, so, so we just show up. Uh, for us, we came women, we meet actually at least three times a year because we have Art and Feminism work, uh, at Etaton. I know we've we talked about it before, and we do it uh, along together with Artbot. It, uh, it's been going on since 2017, um, and we meet uh, every March 8th, around March 8th, for uh, Women's Day. Uh, more than 20 new articles be written every year in average. Uh, 20 to 30 women are coming to write articles together and it, uh, it's a great uh, tradition. Uh, so one more thing about community. Do you know that girls go to bathroom together? Do you have those women at work that they sit at the same office every day long, but they still go to bathroom together, right? Because uh, we, I mean, I myself, I like to know that if I'm going somewhere, I'm going to meet, meet people that I know from before, right? So try to invite friends for a party. If it's a man, we'll just probably say, I'm bringing the beers, right? Or maybe he'll ask what's there to eat. And a woman, uh, she will probably ask you who else is going to be there, right? So when I know uh, I'm going to meet people that I know from before, it's easier for me to show up. Uh, one more thing about language. Uh, using unbiased language can be helpful. Uh, and this was actually Draw initiative. Um, he he uh, suggested to change it. It used to be before C also uh, for the female use of it, and now it's plural, both men and women. And this is the user. It says here user in female. You added the last um, character, and it's for female. So, community manager matters in my day job. I'm a social media manager, and I um, combine this in my Wikipedia life as well. Uh, along with Danny, I'm the administrator of our Facebook group. We also have a Telegram group and a few other WhatsApp because Israel is used WhatsApp a lot. Uh, I also do that. Let's just real quick. Uh, when I need something, I like to use the wisdom of the crowd. I post it up on my social media channels, and then I ask people for help. Um, that's a cake that I wrote about. Um, here, I needed some examples, uh, and they were all in English um, and not just relevant, not so relevant for Israeli culture, so people helped me out. 
comments, as you can see, 68 comments, and now it's in Wikipedia. That's one more thing. And yeah, so uh, that's us like a month ago. Um, and those are the women, that's me, and those are the women in Israel. Uh, give them some love.